Okay, so hello friends. Today our topic is the entry wound versus the exit wound in a firearm injury. So in a firearm injury, when the bullet here is the body wall. Okay, when the bullet enters, this is called the entry wound, and when the bullet comes out from the body, it will cause the exit wound. Okay, now here see the features. So first one is the size of wound. So in case of entry wound, the the size of the wound will be smaller. Okay, you can see there. But in case of exit wound, it will be larger. Here it is the exit wound, and it is the larger. Next is margins. In case of entry wound, you can see that this the bullet will enter like this. So the margin will be in inverted. Okay, but when it will come out, it will like this. So here the margin will be inverted next is bleeding here in tune the blood vessel rupture is less the less number of blood vessels is ruptured here but in case of exit wound more number of blood vessels get ruptured okay so the bleeding will be more next is grease color the bullet will cause two types of color the first one is the grease color from inside and the outside color is the called abrasion color the grease color so here in entry wound grease color and abrasion color both are present but in case of exit wound both are absent next is contusion color in ex entry wound it is present in exit wound it is absent next is soot deposition so here first entry wound the bullet due to burning property it will cause here the deposition of the soot around the entry wound but in case of exit wound the soot deposition is absent so that's it for today the lecture of exit wound versus entry wound so guys if you like this video please do not forget to hit the like button and please do subscribe